We end tonight with a grisly discovery, or more to the point, discovering whether a product can stand up to a grizzly. Here's Carter Evans. This time of year, bears are hungry and foraging for food just about anywhere they can find it. And these particular bears are some of the best in the business when it comes to getting the goods. Are some better product testers than others? Very much so. Randy Gravatt knows exactly what a bear wants. And we have some fish. I smell it. <laughs> it's his job to tempt bears to break into coolers and garbage cans at the nonprofit Grizzly and Wolf Discovery Center in Yellowstone National Park so manufacturers can make them even stronger and save bears' lives. There's a saying out there, a fed bear is a dead bear. And once they get a taste for it, they'll keep coming back? They will. And that's bad news for the bears, because when they get too close to people, they're either euthanized or relocated. This 350-pound grizzly is named Spirit. She was one of the eight resident grizzlies relocated to the Discovery Center. For about 500 bucks, companies can find out if their containers are truly bear-resistant, to the delight of park visitors like Vicki Sumner. He just kept managing to move that thing around until he just, like, cracked it right open. And now you know which cooler you might bring with you, huh? Yeah, the white one. <laughs> <laughs> she and others watched a 600-pound bear named Cora use the tried-and-true CPR method to pop the top on this trash bin. The containers that survive a 60-minute mauling can be sold as bear-resistant, but not all are successful. So this doesn't look so good? No, no. You can see all the styrofoam, so they were able to literally tear that apart. Even this steel trash locker was no match for the bears. They just yeah. ripped the hinges they right ripped off? ripped the hinges right off. When you first started, only 10% of the containers were passing the bear test? And now it's around 65. So the manufacturers are getting it figured out. So the ultimate goal is to benefit the bears out in the wild. Saving bears one cooler at a time. Yes. Carter Evans, CBS News, Yellowstone. My trash can wouldn't stand a chance. That's the CBS Evening News. I'm Anthony Mason in New York. Thanks for watching. Good night.